guys, it is Pius at JSP here again. Uh, today we will be going over a video of setting up your leech bot for D2 ETAL. If you do not know what that is, or if anything is confusing to you during this video, I suggest stopping it, going back to the original installation and setup, watching all of that, coming back here. If you still have any questions after that, uh, feel free to inbox it, post it as a comment, or PM me on JSP. So, getting started from your ETAL folder, we'll go, go to D2MT, um, your ETAL manager, we'll set that up first. <clears throat> we'll click add because this is going to be a new one. So we'll do it as Leecher. Um, same thing as before, like I said, if you haven't watched your, the other video, if you don't know what we're doing at this point, this is all setting up uh, the stuff. So running multiple CD keys again, that was covered in another video. Um, please do stop and watch that if anything is confusing to you. Every 10 runs, um, like normal uh, leeching account, it doesn't really matter because I'm not going to run it, but we will do uh, demo dash, not really my account, but you know. So pick our realm again, US East. We will pretend that it is the fourth character, so it will pick four on the character position. Now, for game name, you do have to put something. You can leave it as random, but I normally just put it as R. Um, it doesn't matter. And we will be using D2 Leech Starter <clears throat> NTJ. We will not be using 2.2. Um, that is best used with Leader Starter. Um, we're not going to go into that. So this is your normal leech. Go down to ntleechstarter.ntj. We will click OK. Click Save twice, just to so make sure it saves. Close out of it. So we're going to go up here to Scripts. We are going to go down to Leech Starter, right here. Not Leech Starter 2.2, but down under Friendless Leech, Leech Starter. Boom. Open that up. So, here is your leader's account name. Everything that we do will be case sensitive, even for the TB commands. Keep that in mind. If there's a capital halfway through it, you have to have the same capital. So, we will use my account, Pius. So that is my account of my leader, and the character's name is B. Game passwords, if you have them, you know, some people like to do it, so if the password is QQ, no capitals, that's exactly what we're gonna put. CD trick, this must be true. If you want to change CD keys, that is actually something I forgot to mention in my video before. But CD trick is true, which means every 10 runs, it will quit and it will join back in using new CD keys. Alrighty, set to true to join after each game. It will join a chat. Message, if you wanted to say something, I prefer not to because if it spams the channel, you can get kicked. Uh, random channel for me is false. I run out of op monarchs. I would like my leechers there as well. And other than that, everything else is basically set up. Uh, your game length, this is the minimum game length. Again, it is in milliseconds, so we will want to set it to um, if you're doing bail runs, your runs are probably going to be about. 120,000 here because that is two minutes. Normally that's what our runs were, so we will set it up for that 120,000. Uh, everything else is already set up, so that's all that we changed in here. We put the account name of the person we're following, the character name of the person we are following, and the password. Click save, save again just to be safe. Comes out of it up here to NTBot. Alrighty, so from this screen, we will click on character configs. We will go down to, I'm gonna delete that. Okay, so assassin is the class that I'm gonna be doing. Um, I will show you how to set up for a leech fighter or for a corner dunce, either one. Um, it's just basically the same setup except for the skills at the bottom. So mine's going to be an assassin. I always copy and paste the original file just so I don't have to worry about something messing up and not having something to fall back on. So control C, control V, copy and paste it. Rename it like the first video, case sensitive as always. Like I said, if you haven't seen the first video yet and you are lost, 
please stop, go back and watch that. It is pretty extensive and should clear up everything. So like always, the config check at the top, slash slash, go down here. Leader's name is the character name of the one you will be following. Case sensitive, so mine is B, no capitals. Party on leader means, oh, party only leader, sorry, it means it will only party your leader and not anybody else. I always set that for true because people will party you, you'll make two parties, it's a mess, blah, blah, blah. So I do that. Party max time, I set it at 60 seconds just so in case something happens and the bot takes about 30 seconds to start, you won't leave the game and keep coming back. Um, leech fighters, you will want true under leech bow um, if you're just a corner dunce. Really doesn't matter because you'll be fine. We will scroll down here to Bale, Universal Bale Leech. We will remove the slashes. One is a Leech Fighter. If you want to be a Leech Fighter, you will leave one. If you want to be a Quarter Dunce, you will leave it for three. Take TP Bale means when you will go in the TP. If you are, if you are a Leech Fighter, you will do the hot command. So for us, it would be hot. But I am not, I am setting up a corner dunce, so mine will be the safe TP, and it is safe. Case sensitive, so if they have a capital F, everything else is lowercase, you have to have that capital F or you will sit in town. Waste a lot of time, you'll be very angry. Um, the grab shrine, I never use, never mess with it, so I just delete what it says. Saving is always a good thing in case you mess up, you can just close out, reopen it. Okay, so that's all we need. We will go down, as I said in the first video, we will set the max game time at 300, just in case something happens, you don't want to stay in there all night. Um, chicken settings, all that stuff needs to be set up like the original video, but you should know how to do that. Your inventory must be set up. You cannot have a full inventory, so if you are full of 45 life grand charms, 20 life, 5 all res, small charms, you don't have to be cool to leech bail, get rid of some of them. So I always do at least two rows of ones, which means it will put them up. And you can do two to three rows, three to be safe. You wanna make sure that you have a TP tome inside. Um, it'll kind of help everything. Other than that, you already know how to set up all that kind of stuff. You also know about setting up down here. Public mode doesn't matter because you're a leecher, but you know, turn off the declone, set up to false, SOG, wait time, all that garbage. You know, if you have a mercenary, regardless of passive or fighting, you can use a mercenary. So I suggest getting one if you're going to be passive because some straggles do get away, you know, and you will chicken, blah, blah, blah. If you have an enigma, obviously set that to true. Um, you know, your ping, you want it, but like I said, I've already already set up all this kind of stuff. Okay, my work PC does not have what it takes to do this. So, okay, um, scrolling down, if you are a fighter, you will set this stuff up. If you are not, you can just leave it as one, or you can set it up as a fighter as well. Um, I don't know what the assassin trap commands are, so I'm just gonna not set that up. I'll probably just leave it as one the whole time. All the way down. But you do have to change this. You can't leave it as the minus one. As far as I know, I've always had problems. So I just put the skills in um, just in case I want to switch from passive to fighting sometimes. Other than that, down here, um, if you use on an assassin, you know, you will have these spe specific ones at the bottom uh, for Cloak of Shadows, Blade Shield, use traps, use fade. You know, use BOs, use Venom, all that kind of stuff. So set that up as you want. But, you know, Amazons have different ones. Everything has different stuff. Um, so other than that, you are good to go. We will close out of it. Open it up. Go to D2NT, Etal Manager. You know, you'll click on your leecher, run, put your password in. I'm not going to do it because I just set up a fake account. Um, so if there's any questions, any concerns, any problems, um, please comment here and let me know so I can cover them or so I can edit it into the video and re-upload it or PM me at JSP, I'd be more than happy to explain it. If there's any videos that you want done, um, I would be happy to do them. Just post, PM, comment, do whatever you want. Just let me know somehow. 
I'll get it done as quickly as I can. I enjoy helping, so don't mind asking, even if it's not very stupid. The only dumb question is a question that was never asked. So, that being said, have a good day.